Hello everybody and welcome to the Nether Block, the show where we build a 64 by 64 by 64 block of nether rack in, theory. in not creative mode. What is it called? I, I always mode. get to that part and stumble. No. Adventure mode. No! Survival mode. It's not, it's survival mode. Survival mode. <laughs> Adventure time. <laughs> Come on, call your friends. We'll travel to very distant lands. I love that show. You know, I was actually really hard pressed to not like that show for a really long time because I had an ex boyfriend what? who was obsessed with it. And then. Oh. Also, there were bullies, oh. like a gang on your street that yeah, like. Yeah, no, I was just. I, anybody who likes the adventure, like adventure time. time. After we broke up, he tried to get me to like it so bad, and I was like, no. You go suck it. Oh, uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, first of all, is this like the toxic boyfriend that we no, know about? No, this was the first boyfriend. Okay. Okay. So I, I can, I, I can, I can not hate him. Is that uh, okay, or is it? I mean, do I need you, to you hate can him hate too? and not hate whoever you want, there, Al. Well, no, I, I already think we know have enough. There There's another the... fella who had been in your life who it does. I don't oh, know anything who, great who about sued him. Sued me? Yeah, no, we can hate him. Yes. No, this is not the same. No, I was just thinking about like I did paperwork to my life. <laughs> if he's like in the middle of suing you and also like by the way, <laughs> have you heard about this great? That would just be my luck <laughs> for sure. <laughs> you really gotta check it out. Also, my lawyer has been in contact with you, right? <laughs> You've been served, through the lawyer, Albert. You right? can't have direct contact. <laughs> yeah. Yikes, yeah, no. You've been served your summons papers also adventure time. <laughs> you should probably check did that out. Did you catch out. the new episode? <laughs> I think this character reminds me of you a lot. <laughs> yeah, no, thank God. Not. The Which fact was that it, it's still super weird that it's after you've broken up. Yeah, like, yeah I agree too. That's why I was like, like, leave me alone. Oh, shoot. I don't know how to fix this. Oh, my God. Did he, was the show out at the time or did he know about the show before he broke oh, up? Oh, ow. Um, or, or was oh, he using it to like get back together with you somehow? Like, by the way, now that we're not was together. He holding as out far on you? as I can remember, we were kind of, you, kind of seeing each other after everything went down. And that's when he was like, you should look at this because another girl showed me it. And I was like, huh, ah. <laughs> I'm leaving so now. So he's in sales. Wow. <laughs> I did. I did that to my wife with red versus blue, and she was fine. So Wait. maybe the problem is with you. And you hadn't broke. You weren't another girl. Your ex-wife. Another girl that you were sleeping with. No, no, just another girl. You didn't say. You didn't say anything. I about me, kind of. Was that not a good illusion what? that I did? Like a, illusion? Alaskan illusion. island. Like alluded to 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 the allude. Eskimos? Is that not? I think it's correct grammar. Am I stupid? I might be stupid. I don't know what you're trying to say right to now. To elude. What is the <laughs> this verb? This is what it was like on the stream last when, night, sort of. When you, what is the verb? Yeah, elude. But what's like? You should elude. Can you elude the police? I don't know if you can do it as a. You alluded to it. You not illusion did. It's illusion. Ah. Is like like illusion, but illusion. It's how. Yeah, Tony like left that. the game. Bye, Speaking <laughs> of illusions. Uh, I did watch. I don't know if we talked about this on the Nether Rack. Can Comet recommended uh, yes, it was Magic on the for Nether Humans. Oh, yeah. I just edited it. Um, that is a lovely show on Netflix that me and that my wife. That invisibility one really has enjoying. been going around quite a bit. Uh, I didn't realize that was from that show, but I've seen the invisibility one like three or four times. In, it's so. On I mean, and, we talked about. We've been talking about sort of like shareability recently, and that's one of those things oh. where I was like, I this is. It's blowing my mind. A how much work he does to get this guy to believe it. It's not really a magic trick, right? Like it it's is for that illusion, one yeah. dude. But like you, everybody knows how he's doing it. But just to see like how how the dude reacts, how hard everybody else works to make him believe that he's invisible. I mean, it, it was. I didn't realize. I haven't seen yeah, it. it was confusing to look one. at. I saw that one on uh, Reddit the other day. Like it was. Yeah, it's 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 been around. I didn't realize again it was that show. The, it's like a it's like a <laughs> you know outdoor performer musking. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's what we got out of last week. The way he like the I mean it's really simple stuff, but like there's the there's the moment where the lady takes a selfie. Did do you remember that from the video? No. Because they prep it like he gets everybody ready beforehand, um, and uh, one of the things is like this lady walks up to him and like has her friend stand behind the chair where the dude is, they take a selfie, and he's not in the picture because they, like, took it ahead of time? Yeah. Yeah, it's crazy. Um, it's a lot of prep work. When but, like, so it's yeah, it's like a massive con. Also, they have to be all be paid, if not paid. Yeah, yeah, gotta, yeah I guess. He said he got them off of Craigslist. Yeah. You don't have to pay them. Like, people just want to be on TV. I guess, but then you risk, like, a schmuck, like, screwing it up. 
Well, then Which maybe you just happens scrap the occasionally episode, and then they just, you know? yeah, yeah, you just go terrible. find another yeah, person. Yeah, I think about that sometimes. Like, I'm, they say no camera tricks, and I believe them. All right? Because I've seen magic before, and, you know, magic can be done pretty well like that. Um, but that you also think, like, what if this goes bad, they just don't include it in the episode. Yeah. yeah. Like, editing oh. is a thing. Also, though, he uses, he uses magic to convince the guy... Okay, first of all, it's probably the people have no idea what we're talking about. <laughs> The gag is that like it's he's a street performer and he you know he's got a chair out in a park, two chairs out, and he's gonna turn the people, the volunteers who show up, invisible. And everyone but one person is in on this, so even the other volunteer is part of the act. And yeah, he actually, he actually does, make does that guy the trick where he makes disappear. him disappear. And I have no um, idea how. It's good. Yeah, that's he, the thing. He does real magic. good magic, and he also has him like quote unquote pick up a cup, and the cup levitates. So the person in the second chair, who is not in on the act, is like, oh, that guy really turned invisible. And then he, quote unquote, makes, you know, the rube invisible, but he's clearly just there. But everyone acts like he's invisible. And I, do they, I, do they do have a big reveal? Are they ever like... You were never actually uh, no, he in just the makes him, He turns him back. And they never even, do, I'm sure someone tells him, but like, I, I'm wondering, like, how do they end? Like, okay, so he makes the kids cry. <laughs> he makes this guy invisible and then turns him back. Does he have like a... Tada moment in any of these, or does he well, like? Well, so the, the guys leave, like there's leave. a premise in each of them. Uh, the one with the kids and the marshmallows was about, I believe that one was about self control. Uh, the one uh, with the guy being invisible was about what can you make people believe, and mm -hmm. so he kind of goes on an arc through the episode in like a, you know, sort of exploring this idea of how how much can we get people to believe, and the end of the episode is actually him going to people. On, like he's standing outside this van as it's a it's a florist van he's like free get your flowers get your flowers and then when people walk by he's like but, uh, not, not actually about the flowers man I'm like here telling people about the NSA and they've got chips in you and like he gets these people to come in who, who he tells have chips in their arms and he does this trick he where pulls he pulls a chip out of their arm and I don't okay. know how he does it I mean obviously it's a trick but it's a real good trick it's a convincing trick and the, every, to a person they're all like man thank you yeah. Like, I did not, cannot believe that the NSA is tracking us like that. And he doesn't, like, reveal it to them that it was a trick. Like, that that's the end of the episode. <laughs> maybe yeah, afterwards, maybe that's... Release. I'm sure at some point, like, it's not on camera where he's like, by the way, I'm teaching everyone a lesson. Like, on camera, he's just no, a No, but he had, I mean, they can see the camera, so they might just be like... You get, have somebody come up and be like, hey, man, we're gonna put this up on YouTube. Like, I just need to be legal here and sign this release. The NSA, you know... Needs to Does be it want us taking their chips out? Yeah, or you could so be you like, have to sign yeah. a legal waiver? Yeah, is it like, like, I, I, I bet he, even he can do it. Be like, hey, NSA. is it cool? Are you all in is the it nether? Cool if I, uh, right now? Yes. yes. I'm in the nether. Okay, now. I'm going to sleep till it's day. Ooh, good Sleeping idea. Day. I'll come back. No, don't wait. Don't go. Don't go. Okay, wait. No, I mean, oh. I've, I've got a ways to go before I get there, but if you get it to be day, then I can mine some or put some more blocks down. It's not like the the forest with their day night cycle. It makes no sense. Mm hmm. I, it's not about the cycle. It Maybe makes you wait sleeping? a certain amount of time before you can use the bed. I'm almost positive that's what it is, because it doesn't want you being able to always run there at night. It's like 12 hours plus a bunch, so you have to like at least survive some of the night. We actually had like a non-fail stream last night of that. Went really well. I like that fort, except for command. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, you're amazing, but it was just... I just actually found it in the VOD, where you were like, Oh no, I'm on fire! Like, outside? <laughs> Oh, no! <laughs> Don't burn our place down. It's raining outside. You should be okay. You're still on fire. And he ran to the lake. <laughs> you, you have to see it from my point of view. It's so funny. Because you run into the door into the cabin, and then you just hear you go, Oh, no! Again. And then you run out of the cabin, and you're on fire again. It was too... And then you run into the lake. Having not played this game, I'm a little bit in the dark. On um, what <laughs> is so why is she on fire? Uh, because you go into the fire, fire damage. Yeah. And if you oh. step on a campfire, you know you can light on fire, and it happens a fair amount because you're always trying to cook or put water on. And sometimes you walk too we far. We put one inside but the thing <laughs> to try to get warm. <laughs> Three people inside a cabin meant for like two people or like a nice little shed, and we just couldn't get out the door, and everybody stepped on fire, and it was a little bit of a mess. No, 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 no. It was just commands. <laughs> I stepped on it once. It happened again later. <laughs> Did you, you, so you guys have like your campfire right in, like inside or right outside the door? <laughs> right inside, so because we were, we were all okay. freezing even though it's a jungle. Yeah, it was cold that night. It's cold that night. 
Is it dark? I thought it was a forest. But you make a you make like your camp. Oh no, no! Get away! <laughs> Damn your wordplay! Back. Feel um, argumentative yeah, the today. First, the Alan's first been night too that. Uh, yeah, Al and I are gonna end up fighting. Good. <laughs> fight! 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 Yeah, you were trying to egg me and Joe on. That wasn't <laughs> yeah, very nice. It's not fun when she's in the fight, apparently. Uh. Um. That was the first time we hit cold, to that extent. Like we were almost dying. Is there a season in the game? Like, do they? Uh, do you have to That's deal with some winter for a while? Question? Oh, you can build snowshoes so. and stuff. So I assume there's at least a wintry area. Oh, I'm retarded. But there is a way to beat that game, and I think you just have to go to these different caves and get different like swipe cards and figure out the mystery and find where the kid is and all this. I want to do that stuff. Kid? Stupid kid. Your yeah, son yes. gets taken. Oh, it's, like, well, it's well, like Fallout 4. Yeah, but, yes. but instead of searching for our son, we rebuild civilization and become cannibals. Basically. <laughs> well, when you become so cannibal, you get exactly like Fallout 4. Yeah. yeah, actually, that's pretty spot on. Well, it's harder to become a cannibal in Fallout 4. You don't get as many human meat drops. Yeah, it takes a while yeah, to get up like that Yeah, you can uh, eventually get endurance. human meat, but not right away. To get up that endurance tree. But, uh, yeah, we were expecting to get clobbered, so we made a really good base and just kept building and building and had s s very light attacks to the point where we're like, let's build a dock out to that, like, we had, like, a... <laughs> if there had been, like, a entertainment tab to build stuff, we probably would have started digging into that, because we were like, well, we could build... I mean, I built a catapult that's pretty entertaining. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Can you put Nintendo. zombies in the catapult? Can you put skulls in the catapult? I haven't tried. How, why, how not? Have you not? Like, a skull the skulls yeah, yeah, like, that's, that's the... the dis the disadvantage of not having me in this game. I that's think that's a very so, Tony thing yeah, to do. Like, I'm surprised I haven't loaded that thing up with like arms and heads. Because you can definitely well, take short supply. Off of every single person you kill and put them on sticks. And then you I summon weird monsters that way. Uh, no. Oh, that's you, Tony. Right? He's not the weird monster. Me? That's really me now. There's just like a flaming thing flying back and forth. I'm what? on the nether block. Oh, are you fighting a go- oh, you're- J Joe's fighting a ghost. A ghost. Ow! Yes. Ghost. I got him for you, Joe. I like- I like playing ping pong with him. Oh, I'm he's, sorry. He's dead. No, you you didn't say- any, I didn't realize- I didn't know I what was happening. I wasn't fighting him, we were having a, a rounding ball match of tennis, you- God, you killed him. <laughs> I did. Fred! That was like the third oh. time Al killed somebody's tennis that partner. That was my best man! Are you kidding me? <laughs> Did you name him? Oh, my imaginary wife is gonna be crushed. <laughs> he was the Got best man at your wedding. Pink. Yes, yes, my dog will be crushed. You're Eddie gonna marry your dog? Week. She got Some bit and had to wear a cone. Eddie got bit and had to wear a cone, you said? Though? Yes. Aw, she's satellite head. Yeah. She was. I couldn't bear to leave it on too long. It was a bad parent. What are Alan yelling about? What? Tima said some people have married their dog, and I don't think that's actually uh, accurate. Somebody's married uh, the Eiffel they? Tower. Somebody's married their dog. Yeah, there's people that have married roller Not coasters. Not legally. Yes. Someone married the Eiffel yes. Tower? How did the Eiffel Tower did not consent? I agree with how does the Eiffel Tower consent? Was, also, how does it sign thing. the marriage certificate? Yeah, there's so many like, no, this won't work things about that. <laughs> Listen, there's a documentary you have to believe in it. love, Albert. <laughs> they, can, <laughs> they can make it work. There's also a documentary on veganism being a good idea, and you don't see that being true. Don't push your Burned. belief on other people. <laughs> <laughs> Quiet. There's I was waiting for Komet's reaction. Like, I don't care. I don't, I'm not a vegan, yeah. but I didn't know if Komet was all about the uh, veg no, vegetables I, or not. No, I, I mean, I love vegetables. I just love meat. Yeah. Yum, yum. Ooh. Eat them up. Delicious meats. I've been encountering a lot of vegans lately, and it's starting to bother me. That's well, you do live in liberal Colorado. Yeah. I live in a college town we are a in swing Colorado. State. Thank you very much. We are we are a little bit of both. If you go out east, it's as red as it gets. If you go into the mm -hmm. mountains, it's very red. Spires if you stay on the front range, it's pretty much like full on communist Russia. Do you want to get political <laughs> here? Because we just had our uh, our, no. our primaries in Florida. <laughs> I really don't. There and the two guys who won. We had the the guy who like. How, managed to out Trump the other conservative, right? So literally, it was like you know, love Trump, can't think of anything I disagree with him about. Like, just really super Trump, loves Trump. And then the other guy who won, it was very surprising. Bernie Sanders backed candidate. Huh. So you have the the like this. The, I I looked at that headline and I was like, this is exactly what I didn't want. 
<laughs> I wanted to have like somebody somewhere in the middle of the road and now I have literal socialist yeah. or like the dude who cannot think of anything to disagree with Trump about. During the whole election, <laughs> um, I lived with two people at the time. One is one of my ex-boyfriends and um, he Ow. was like, as far as you can get red, um, war, like war veteran, um, super, super conservative. And then the other person I lived with was my best friend and she was hardcore feminist, um, really, really, really blue left wing. And I wanted to shoot myself. <laughs> it, 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 I just got to sit. Yeah, I got to sit behind and watch while these two yeah, people yeah, say yeah, the I most can tell you idiotic. which one of those friends would be able to help with that. Uh, yeah. <laughs> right. That's true. One of them can solve your problem. God, I just like so, I was like, why can't you both hear how stupid you're being? And they're like, man, <laughs> I just leave. That's why I don't really. <laughs> that does sound pretty stupid. Yeah, they didn't even say words. They just whined. They just made baby Wait. noises at each other. Uh, it might as well. So it's tonight's debate. Like it, yeah. <laughs> where? 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 Like the villagers in Minecraft. Where, where, where. Or the or the the mom in Charlie Brown. But more, way more annoying. The glass ceiling. Wah wah wah. That noise was tax cuts for the wealthy. Wah wah. American flags for everyone. Abortion. So um, I did build a home, everyone. For liberals only. Pivot. I thought you didn't want to tell people about it. I'm gonna tell them that it's it's built, but it exists. Yeah. Also, apparently there's some 1.3 chunks out there, accessible-ish. Yeah, that's why 1. there's all of a sudden a bunch of different fish in my fish tank. Did someone fish the fish tank fish? Yeah, I Full don't know fish. who put that in there, but if you guys go by the fish tank, it's been much improved. There's even, like, seaweed and, like, clownfish and stuff. Oh. <gasps> what? Well, clownfish were in the old that's one, though. I hadn't cool. seen them yet. Well, clownfish were in the old one, but I hadn't seen one floating around in the water yet. Yeah, I hadn't seen one, a catchable, a bucketable one. If you go fishing, do the fish you catch be alive? I have Be alive. <laughs> do the fish you catch be alive? Be alive. <laughs> That's a Ooh, soundboard. Oh, there's sand at the bottom? Something that got fancy with so this. That was so weird. <laughs> weird sounding. I got in the middle of that sentence and I just had to go with it. From I don't get to edit to myself right, so. once I start saying something dumb. <laughs> it's just, yeah, I, what's the fun in just yes. like halting and restarting a sentence? <laughs> like we have I have not actually fished with the fishing pole yet since the update. I've only fished with a bucket. Oh, we could always figure that out. Yep. Well, I'm, I I'm know you can <laughs> throw food in the water. Wait, no, that might be Zelda. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna you're say on, you can, you're on lockdown on Zelda. I am also, not. You cannot. You don't oh, yeah, have, you have that to power, lose a sir. challenge or something. I forgot about that. Uh, also, I'm playing this crazy thing like, where I put uh, down nether blocks. Weeks. Hey, I did like seven stacks. Thank you very much. Oh. Yeah, I've done about that. You judge me. More. Do you have a, a hint of a twang? What? Do you have a hint of a twang? Is there a Colorado accent? No. I, Actually, to John Jones, oh my lord. Why is John there a gas Jones right here? Pe What's up? There's like a... <laughs> Hello? <laughs> no, <laughs> leave me alone. Can you hit me through the nether portal? portal? Oh, is it that close? Like, yeah, you guys gotta... Co <laughs> it's spoopy. <laughs> <laughs> You, I got I on the call for him for like a can second I jump on top of earlier. Ah. You were talking about <laughs> accents. It sounded like Komet had like a British accent. I have a really good British accent, but it's not my I, own. I've been were you doing it, it for a second earlier? Shouldn't. Um. When did uh, that happen? When did you mention that? Mention my. I on Komet all sorts. I was making fun of her dancing on stream, making fun of her British accent. <laughs> yeah. Not that. Not you hating on her. I'm either having deja vu or Komet has, has mentioned her British accent. I have. Sure. Never heard the British accent. Commit your own restriction from talking about your British accent. <laughs> no, she has to lose a challenge. There's gonna be some challenges in Dark Souls him? later, apparently. You weren't doing you saw anything how with close that. He was? Gas, where you commit? That was crazy. Say that again. I said you weren't you weren't uh, trying to saddle that gas or something, were you? Um, no. I mean, I wanted to see if I could okay. get on top of them, but that's okay. If you have a saddle, you can. So you re oh, really? I legitimately did. I have killed gas out from under every thing? single person <gasps> here now. What is that Except thing? Tony, yes. I don't oh, know I, you, I, I, Tony was trying to saddle one, wasn't he? At one point. Not oh, this what is this? Not this episode. No, I'm sorry. Just at one point. It's like a lava slinky cube. Yeah, oh, magma, cube. magma cube. Oh yeah, go. Uh, I actually really like that description, though. It's a lava slinky. <laughs> I also enjoyed that description. 
good word. I didn't. I didn't pick it up. I had to like. <laughs> I would not have gotten to magma cube from what you were saying. <gasps> oh, I, know she was. Was. <laughs> I know what you see. Yeah, they split open. <laughs> this fish tank is awesome. And we built it. I, yep. I think what like uh, once we actually get Optifine back and the glass will be a lot clearer. That'll be really cool. Yeah. And the water will. Are the fish making noise? You could get you could get better glass like in stock Minecraft anyway. Like, can you make clear uh, glass? Clear glass? Yeah, you can dye it if you dye if you make white glass. Let's make it clear. Is there a noise coming it from the fish tank? It does make it clearer. They need to add octopi. If you add There's clear squid. dye to the glass, they have squid. Yeah, what's the difference? Because I, I don't think you can bucket a squid. Try it. No, they 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 are as unfunctional as they have ever been. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> it's like you need black ink. That's about the only use. They're not in the sky anymore. I still understand what you were saying about dyeing the clear glass clear. No, dyeing well, it white. Yeah, Al said to dye it white, and I think that would make it even harder to see the fish. Yeah, I, need, I think any dye this? is worse than clear. You can make panes. Panes might be clearer. Yeah, but then you've got like a weird gap between the pane and the water, but that yes, might do. be okay. Just, it's weird. It'd be weird, but it'd be cool. It's cool, weird. Cooler if you did. Maybe they uh, fixed that in 1.13. I was just wondering that. I don't know what type of. Uh, oh, oh, this. oh! That wasn't nearly, nearly as successful as I was hoping. It's dropping. Be. Is it what? What's dropping? Nether quartz. What does that do? I put it in a box. I was making a frame. I'm not really collecting it because it's above a chasm, but. One of them nerd chasms. So, back to the Colorado accent. Apparently we have no. something that happens a little bit on ours, and according to John Jones, for sure is something that all Coloradoans say, but I think that's because he's heard me and Lindsay say it, and Lindsay picked it up because I said for sure too much. Um, statistically, sure. Sure. Colorado accent is a lack of accent. Statistically. Well, you are in the center, so yeah. you have, like, all the stuff sort of melding in and canceling everything out. Yeah, but Texas is in the center and they're kind of doing their own thing. Yeah, they're way south. That's true. Well, how do you they say get the name of your state? Center. center south. Everyone say the name of that state. Texas? Texas. No, not that state. The state committed Colorado. Uh, Tony Levin. Colorado? Colorado. Colorado? Yeah, so we so are rad John, in Colorado. Colorado. Yeah, I go, I go much but, more of the O. But according to like actual... Colorado? Um, Colorado. Statistics and like research. <laughs> our accent is a lack of accent. Same with Washington State. Washington. Makes yeah, no people sense. say California oh. doesn't have an accent. It, like, or if it is, it's the surfer bro. But I think it's more like the the up things where it's just like you've got this really weird concern thing, and you bring it up towards the end of a statement because you're trying question. to virtue signal yeah. and be better than everyone. Ah. ah! I'm okay. I hate you, Californians. Okay, I hate you all. <laughs> I was falling in Actually, I like a lot of Californians. I just don't want you in my state. You guys can just bugger yeah, It really seems leave. like... The, the fact that, like, it's a beautiful state, but also, like, it's kind of full of people who are... Well, I say full of... It's actually kind of a swing state, too, really. Which state are we talking about now? California. Oh, California's gigantic. Yeah, California has... It's so what, big. There's 20 million people in the LA area. Yeah. California has just more the population people. than all of uh, Australia. The influencers in California tend to be liberals because they're from the cities. Whereas, like, there's a bunch of sort of, you know, country area of California where people tend to be more uh, conservative for whatever reason. It's just um, rural versus, like, urban. Yeah, I guess it's about, like, like self-sufficiency? Yeah, that's, that's most of it. Like, whenever you have to rely on yourself more, you don't think of it as much as, like, we it's have like, to It's like, I might actually community. see a bear, so no, you can't have my guns. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and, you know, xenophobia and... Yeah, I yeah. might actually see a Mexican, so you can't have my gun. <laughs> <laughs> that went not at all well played, sir. Um, Is that not where you thought that was going to go? <laughs> no, I thought he was going to say you can't have my bears. I don't know where I thought that was going to go. <laughs> At all, I because in my head I was thinking xenophobia is not the right term at all. That's a little harsh. It's just that, you know, like for instance in New York, there are so many different people immigrating here. It's hard to be like, damn immigrants, because it's like you are full of immigrants. They're just everywhere. Yeah, it's just daily life, and you know, you sort of get used to this it. This is this is a real Albert opinion. I think that in general, like the bigger problem with oh. immigrants comes if you have a large volume that the like the population can't acclimatize to, or they can't acclimatize to the population. We yes, have a large really large scale immigration has factors. <laughs> we have a really big oh, problem in Fort Collins with um, 
now, which doesn't make any sense with me, uh, homeless people. Yeah, like, like they really, used to actually really bust bad. them to Greeley. That's why. And then the ACLU said we couldn't do that anymore. Well, and, but the problem is, is why would anybody want to be homeless in Colorado? The winters are hard. I don't think people want to be homeless no, most right. of the time. <laughs> but they, they're traveling here. That's not here. how that works. That's yeah, the thing. It's not, there. There. it's not that they're, they are uh, originally from here and they just become homeless is that they're tr they're traveling here. So what you're saying is people come to your state and become homeless? No, that's I mean, not what I'm prices, saying. Prices pretty much. That's exactly not what I'm saying. I'm saying the opposite. <laughs> people are homeless and then they and travel then come here. To your state. Yeah. I think a lot of them travel here in the summer and it's really nice. It's easier than being like Arizona or yeah. California and then like I they don't leave in time and all of a sudden they're trapped in the Like we've had people die in parks homeless because people, it gets too cold. Do homeless people have a migration pattern? And definitely in California when yep. we when I lived there for sure. You have to have enough money to be able to afford to go somewhere. You keep overestimating how much that costs. People, homeless people have. Um, We've had this conversation. Have have, you, you got to load now. up you and your wife and your three kids. No, it's expensive. And the, and, the, and the switch. No, they move. Yeah. Or they ride the bus. Yeah, and if you don't have like, any, any kids, and you just like hop up, like find a trucker who's willing to take yeah. you down to like some other state yeah. somewhere. How many married job. homeless people do you think there mm, are? Not many. They seem know. like they have a lot of single privilege. <laughs> <I've seen> <laughs> <laughs> Al is envious of the hobos because they have single privilege. No, I am. A, I I, th I do think that they're like. I heard a story about a guy who like after the election was like, and he was a songwriter, so it, he has a songwriter privilege as well. But he's like, I'm just gonna <laughs> leave my phone at home and go on a train ride and like connect. I was like, you, like, I, like I hate there's you. no way you have kids or a wife or anything. <laughs> it's like, is it like the minimalist guys? You're like, I've got all my possessions in a backpack. And I'm like, you don't, you don't have any yeah. kids, do you? <laughs> there's a flexibility. That's why you just put your kids in the married. backpack and go. It's really hard to have that bikimian sort of lifestyle when you're uh, tied down. Like a family person. So they I, never the mentioned that, though. So They're never lines. like, and this person is not going to reproduce, so... You know, good luck with that gene getting passed on. Well, no, they can re like I don't know. Oh, the, yeah, the they're the gonna reproduce. They're gonna move on. There for the kid. Yeah, they're gonna <laughs> have six wives and. Like we had a guy working for us like that had nine kids. kids in six Woo. different states. What? That's not human echoes. <laughs> we didn't have a guy working for us. Like yeah, this was, uh, this was, was my dad was running like that. We had a former <laughs> guy who was just he he should have got a vasectomy. Yeah. yeah. Like at that point, what are you what are you gaining? Uh, uh, he like I think it was kind of his thing. <laughs> Did he was he paying? There was support? an SVU episode about that. <gasps> you could only garnish twenty five percent and split that six ways. Oh, don't say that word. <laughs> <laughs> what? This, don't say uh, garnish. Joe got triggered. That stupid ex boyfriend. It's, these weird forms I don't understand. <laughs> That's my goal for this weekend is to pour over those and figure that out. I just try. Oh God! That's no, they're the coming. power lawyers oh, have. No, they get run! forms you don't understand. What? What happened? <laughs> did you hit the? Oh, no. Did you hit the guys? Oh God! Yes. Okay, I'm running. It, it I'm was, running. I'm getting wait, out. They made a horrible dinosaur shriek before they came after me. Uh, Joe hit a the pig mantas. Man. They're not coming after uh, me. No, 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 no. The manta race. Oh. Oh. It's because oh. you oh. haven't had a Sleep in a bed. I think you had me freaked out. I was running for the stinking tail. Yeah, we were about to like set off the siren and everything. Yeah, what were you about to do? I was gonna try to go to the nether. I mean, I I need to lay some nether anyway. <laughs> wow, that was really disruptive of me. Well, you guys gotta be aware. There's a new thing, and it's terrifying. And if you don't sleep, we, I'm sleeping you regularly. Well, good for you. Yeah, I thought In that fantasy world, stopped right? when you became a dad. <laughs> yeah, I didn't think so that was a real thing for you. You were saying something about kids or something, and I wanted to say something I can't remember. Oh, no, sleeping was. with people. <laughs> Is it a uh, oh, yes, the failed oh, Thursday. Oh yeah. <laughs> How I how push silly this of us! Off the edge, but I don't want to do that. I'm li losing all this nether. What were we talking about before? Garnishment? Single privilege? Accents. No, way before that. Hobos, yeah. traveling, cheap travel, homelessness. Yeah. Oh, I think it was homelessness. I was going to say something about. Oh yeah, New York. I've, I've mentioned this. Like the homeless people here aren't. Very few of them are like down on their luck. You know, just need they a hand out. They choose that lifestyle too. Yeah, it's the, it's Many the of them are mentally lifestyle. ill. Is what I'm saying. Like here, oh. like. If you have a homeless person, he's like sitting in like six pairs of pants, like hitting a bus with a fish, like just screaming about the government. It's like, okay, this is not 
This is this is a different problem. I have an official art happening. request for you, Commit. Um, yes. A man with six <laughs> pairs of pants punching a bus with a fish. Wait, what? <laughs> That's what that I, was whoa. just what Joe said. <laughs> I just said that. Six pairs of pants. I, I, what? I missed that then. No. Six pairs of pants. <laughs> what was that half a second ago? <laughs> What were you dialed in on? Well, you um, know, it definitely Scott wasn't. Scott was opening up a paper bag, problems with and it was kind of loud. <laughs> well, you missed it. Okay, well, it's gone forever. He was opening what? A paper bag. Oh. Yeah, those are loud. Not as loud as those sun chip bags. It was always that loud. Did you guys ever have those? That's so yes. the, the, how that whole so thing loud. happened, though, was so stupid, is that people wouldn't buy them because they were loud, but they were completely... Biodegradable? Yeah. Were they completely? Yeah, I think like they that. were. If you if you were to bury them, they would be gone within a year. Didn't you have to have like certain temperatures? Because I've seen other claims like that, and then it's like, as long as this thing is kept like. Yes. No. If you put it up in the Arctic, below, Joe, it will hang around for a while. No, not that. <laughs> I feel like that would have. I'm gonna. I'm gonna Google. Speaking, speaking, speaking. It has to be kept at 270 degrees until it catches fire. I literally saw something where it had to be like perfect compostable. Uh, temperatures for it to biodegrade. I think it was like some plastic cup in Australia. If you want to talk about mulch, you gotta you gotta get Al involved. He knows mulch? all about that I mulch. mulch. I haven't mulched anything in forever. I gave up on the gardening thing. I tried to the, grow tomatoes this year. Long? You <laughs> gave up gardening. on gardening? That's so sad. I love gardening. It's so hot! Oh, well, I can't help you with that one. Yeah, it's miserable! It's hot here. You I can't even imagine adding 100% humidity in 15 degrees. Ugh. <sighs> You have to like, go outside and stuff. Like, no. It's the summer of swamp ass. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, gardening plus Florida just does not sound like a. My dad time. loves it. And, like, he does it in the evening, so I guess that kind of takes care of a lot of the. That makes sense. Heat. You could get up and do it at um, your like five a.m. since you're up so yeah. early. Yeah. Make a stream. That's out when of it. I do my running usually. Although I have to get the kids ready for school in the morning, so a lot of times running doesn't happen in the morning. Yeah. Did your dad do it while you and your sister were young? Oh yeah. My entire life, my dad's been a gardener. Oh, but he also did like a paper I, helped, I had to help to him. I had to go and like, like fill up the um, the truck with you know horse manure. <laughs> that wasn't for gardening. That was just fun. <laughs> dad was just trolling you. <laughs> like, oh, I'll get my kid to shovel horse poop into this truck. Horse poop's not that bad. Like yeah, the smell is fair enough. It's not like a like you wouldn't. It, it's very dry. It doesn't ha like it smells, but it doesn't smell like. Ugh, it's just sort of. It smells yeah, like the hay. only time it yeah. gets bad is if it's like, it, it's been sitting in the back of a truck and it rains and it's like seeping. Yeah. We would just get it off. They had like a pile at the horse farm. We're just like, okay, back it on up. I was actually trying to find a place here in away. Fort Collins that I could take Scott to because he's a like hard city boy, like. First time he's really been in the so mountains was a couple of weeks ago. <laughs> yes. No, I wanted him to touch a horse. Like, to pet a horse and, like, comb it and stuff. And I was looking for one in Fort Collins. There was a guy that worked for my dad that had never seen a cow before. And he got <laughs> trapped by a cow in a shed. The cow was just curious. Cows are generally pretty they're like nice. They're big cats. Yeah, like, they're basically just big cats. Big and dumb cats. This dude's just freaking out, climbing over stuff, trying to hide from this cow that just wants to be his pet. <laughs> Cows are he really, never really dumb, seen though. a cow like, before. Have you ever seen a cow eat a toe strap before? No. Yeah. I don't know what a toe strap is. I don't know what a toe strap is. Like, yeah. Those ratcheting down like straps that you use on the back of trucks. Oh, I, got, I call that a ratchet oh. strap, but okay. Yes. We, we call them toe straps, but like uh, it's probably actually a ratchet strap. But like, you see a cow go about 15 feet of that until it got to the metal buckle and then just backed away as the. That slobbery, sloppery strap just went out. <laughs> <laughs> like, it came back up out of, it out? Was like, out of one of its stomachs? Yeah, it was inverse uh, inverse spaghetti action. Just like the cow's just backing away, pulling a toe strap out of its mouth. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Whee! I want to hey. see that. Uh, uh. Uh, where am I, I putting the cords? I will say I love those happy Which cow city? things. Like, that's one of my favorite right gifts on the stairs. Online. Right by the stairs. Those happy cow what, machines. The bitch on a cow? Oh, yes. Yeah, those How are. How much so of cute. a city boy is your boyfriend, Kamet? Like, like you say, he's a city boy. Like, like he had never been. So he's lived in Colorado for three and a half years now, and he had never been in the mountains until like two weeks. Until my brother's wedding. Yeah, but hadn't he also been in the mountains That's, in Afghanistan? Well, I mean, he was in Afghan. He was a he's a uh, two-time combat vet, so he went to Afghanistan twice. So 
It's not really a, a vacation. Yeah, no, it's not, it's not really it's a not sightseeing tour. Not quite city boy, I wouldn't think. I <laughs> would be willing to bet if you're out there and you're not getting shot at at this exact moment, you're probably you probably have some time to think, man, this is pretty. Oh yeah, yeah. if it is, it's, it's a beautiful country. But like, they are also the like bathing themselves with baby wipes and like that for seven months straight. So it's not it's not the same. It's a very smelly country. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you, did you just say that he had wet Wi-Fi? We had Wi-Fi. Oh yeah, he had Wi-Fi, so I guess... <laughs> oh, oh, forget so it. So he didn't have to worry about looking outside, he could play Team Fortress. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> he could play Fortress, awesome. <laughs> But uh, he, he stupid mountains. He, okay, no. Here's a great story. Get in the way of our reception. I, so we went up, and um, I have really good friends who have a cabin up in Red Feather. So, and they were kind enough to let us use use it. And um, we were there, and out of nowhere, Scott semi screams, and he points, and he's like, "That, what the f is that?" And he's like, the you would think that it was some sort of crazy wild animal. You know what it was? A cow. A chipmunk. A squirrel. <laughs> a chipmunk. It was a chipmunk. He was like, I was I'm a that? city boy. I've, never I've seen, seen chipmunks. It. Like, I don't think I've ever seen a chipmunk in real life. So I don't know they like, look like though. That's that's how much of a like, city oh, cool. boy is. No, they don't wear giant red shirts. That's okay. Though. I love it. I get to I get to. Um, or uh, educate him. Uh, so I'm gonna take him up when the Aspens change this year. I love teaching people things. I was supposed to take Al deeper into the mountains, but we only went to like the base of the mountains. Mm, yeah. You forgot the gun. We went all the way up to one of the top of like the hills. Yeah, it was probably like <laughs> that. State uh, trooper came by. <laughs> Where did you take him? It was like whoops. Uh, we were out near spotted. Morrison. Like oh. I, so we got we got was a little a bit into the hills. We maybe got like eight thousand elevation. Mm. So we had another six thousand to go. It's a big slinky. Tony had not been uh, <laughs> running at that point now, that very was, much. I felt bad because that was I as much problems with him. my hip pain as it was like me not being oh, was in it? enough condition. I felt like I was leaving you behind um, for a little bit. Yeah, these guys will kill you. You did well in the mountains, though. Better than I thought. Considering like you got a little worried whenever you went up the stairs at the hotel and were winded. Yeah, that first oh, night yeah. will be bad. Well, I did get. To, I guess I acclimatized because I didn't, we didn't go the first day, so maybe the first like. At, I got to deal with it. Also, stairs are... St stairs tough. are hard. D different than just a hike. Some hikes. There was a lot of people out there, though. It was nice. Uh, I remember, like, we were out on this trail, and there was just, like, people with their bikes just going oh, yeah. through. That's normal. Yeah, we, we, we just, just drove until we found whoa. a spot where there, like, was a trail to walk on. I, I probably couldn't find that place again if I tried. Um, I whoa. have a stupid question. Okay. I have a stupid answer. Ah. Um, where do I find like where can I get diamonds to make more diamond like things? in the ground? Yeah, you gotta get to uh, <laughs> hit F three and then go till your axis says eleven, and then just run around for about oh, two hours and you'll find some diamond. Okay. Yeah, they're just rare. Yeah, shockingly. If you can't find any in the in the help yourself boxes, then there are some in the help yourself boxes, but not that many. There's, I don't, I don't really know stashes, what are but help yourself to... boxes and what aren't anymore, and I'm too afraid to ask because I've asked so many times. Arena, <laughs> okay, Chris Pratt. If it's inside the arena, it's a help yourself box. I Joe said if it's not in a house. So one day I went yeah. around, and then the next day he was like, "No, it's not ones okay. that are not." I, so I was like, <laughs> "Now I'm scared because now I think that." Yeah, maybe there's also I stole like, is the trailer stuff. a house? I like, bet I, we're like a, a person's estate. It's hard. Yeah, I guess we don't know exactly what the extent of someone's area is. Yeah, I mean, now I'm just not going to touch anything other than Perfect. outside so this is a of quick the. Quick reminder that if you become a patron, you can actually play on this server so long as yeah. you're not a jerk. So long as you're yes, not a jerk. Do we have patrons who are jerks that diamond. can't play? No, uh, nope. I, that not hasn't yet. happened yet, but I'm sure that there could be somebody who's like, I'll pay the $2 a month and come and break the you entire block. You know what? No, I think oh, that I being see. a patron I can automatically makes someone up. so awesome they're incapable of being a jerk. Yeah, I, I'd agree with that statement. That's been our experience. If you want your wife to love you more, if you want to get laid more often, become a patron <laughs> become a for patron. Human Echoes. If you want your kids to have you're a good sad because you have you. kids. <laughs> Become a patron. If you want horses, uh, to statements like you that Tony to Southcott makes are not legally binding to Human Echoes LLC, nor does he speak as a representative <laughs> of the opinions of LLC or, or oh, the no. powers that be. You're stuck, buddy. We'll see you guys later. Are we done? Bye, everybody. Have a great oh, week. 40 minutes. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Okay, bye. That was a stupid question, also. <laughs> ah! 
Hey guys, thanks for watching our video. If you like the things that we make, you should consider becoming a patron over on patreon.com. There should be a link up on your screen right now or in the description of this video. Click it, go to Patreon, and help us make awesome stuff.